In this video, I wanted to take just a quick second and break down one of my favorite blitzes in Madden 22, and really what I would argue is probably the best blitz in the game this year. And um, we actually did a v defensive ebook on this back, I want to say, in August or early September. And uh, this has been one of my favorite uh, my, my favorite formations all year. My first defensive ebook was actually out of the 3-3-5 odd in the Baltimore playbook, but today we're going to be giving you the pinch to blitz concept out of the nickel 245 odd. We're also going to show you a really interesting little tactic that you can use to make this really effective specifically against any non-play action offense like the gun bunch, for example. And what you're going to see here is we are simply going to turn our auto flip off. We're going to put our auto alignment to base. Now, you can leave your auto flip on if you want to, and you can actually leave it unbase aligned if you want to. Um, but real simple here, all we're going to do is come out in the play pinch two. Now, what we want to do, uh, really important, is we want to make sure that our best um, our best pass rusher is on the outside. So I'm going to put Devin White out here, and then over here I'm going to put Jason Pierre-Paul. We're going to have Shaq Barrett on this side, and then whoever you want at the nose tackle position. And then we actually teach in our defensive ebook a little bit of a trick in terms of how you can get uh, additional adjustments on certain plays and additional things with this in terms of how you can get better personnel in the field. But really, this is just a great defense all around. It's been one of the top metas this year, and I just wanted to break down the simple setup for the blitz. It actually is really simple. I'm going to put my alignment on baseline. I think it's better if it's on base. That's just my opinion. And uh, we're going to come out and pinch too. So all you're, literally all you're going to do is you're going to press – you're going to back this guy up. Now, really, really important, you want to back him up right about here. Okay? At the snap of the ball, you're going to run down, and you're going to click left trigger. And what you'll see, you're going to run down, click left trigger. You'll get this disengage A-gap pressure from the nose tackle. You'll get edge pressure off of the left, and you will get edge pressure off of the right. Now, we teach you how to scheme around this with our defensive ebook. We teach you how to get it only sending two people uh, with that. But as you can see, this is just literally one of the best blitz metas in the entire game. Now, what makes this blitz so good, at least in my personal opinion, is its ability to get pressure consistently against one of the best ways to block in Madden 22, that being the block tight end. And the way that you use this or the way that you can get pressure against a block tight end is you are just simply going to spread your linebackers. And when you spread your linebackers, your user will still go into a really good position. And what you'll get is a little bit more width. And as you can see, we'll be able to get double edge pressure even against a block tight end. Most people in this game cannot get pressure against block tight ends. It's really the meta. And just in terms of this is one of my favorite defenses for the bunch meta. And even more importantly, I think the tight slots. It's actually really good against tight slots. As you can see, the consistency of the pressure. Thanks for watching the video. That's how you get pressure sending five. Last little pro tip here that I like to tell people, if you really want to take this defense to the next level, go ahead and shade your coverage down, and then you're just going to – you can re-soft squat or re-cloud flat your cloud flats, or you can leave them in hard flats. But by shading your coverage down, your vert hook will play a little bit better um, on the wide side of the field. So you want that vert hook to be on the wide side of the field, really important. But as long as you do that, that makes this defense that much better, especially against the underneath stuff. Thanks for watching the video. If you want to get my full nickel 245 odd defensive ebook, there's a link in the description below where you can get that. You can join our Patreon for just $10. It'll we'll get you access to all of our 245 odd defense. And in addition to that, we'll also get you access to the rest of our library of content over there with all of our 30 offensive and defensive ebooks this year. So if you want to check that out, there's a link in the description. It's only $10 to sign up and it gets you access to everything.